thank you guys for being here. Um, we're uh, normally uh, we start the all levels class. I make you guys do uh, three minutes of drill and takedowns, but I wanted to teach a little bit of takedown lately because uh, it looked like it was something that we needed work on. So all month long, I'm going to be teaching the same takedown. It's uh, my favorite setup for an inside trip. It's off the head post. If you were here last week, you've already seen it. Um, I'm going to show it briefly. I'll walk around to help you. We're going to get three minutes. You and your partner going back and forth. One guy's going to hit three head post drag double inside trips, and then the partner's going to hit three. We're just going to run this back and forth for three minutes. This is what it looks like. Uh, Jared, can I borrow you? So I'm here. <clears throat> I'm squared up with Jared. I'm reaching with my back hand for his head. He's going to reach up and take that hand off with the same side hand here. As he takes it down, Part of this is that he's initiating the movement, right? I post, he takes it down. I'm doing two things at once. I'm grabbing the tricep. I'm stepping outside to create an angle. Then I'm going to drag this hand all the way past here, opening the door to his hips. I'm going to let go, and I'm going to bring this arm back in tight by my hips. I call it the gunfighter, right? So I'm here, boom, and I'm hitting that shot. I missed my trip that time. Here. Boom, outside step, inside reach. I'm dragging it across, coming in, hitting that inside trip. Immediately hand on the knee, hand on the hip. So I'm not getting sewed up in his guard. Knee cut pass and finish inside control. I post. And then I'm coming up. Uh, you go M1 to me on belly. I don't care how you pass, but I don't want you staying down. I don't want this. Getting sewed up like everybody who faces past me. Questions? One more time. One, two, three. And my shoulder's hitting his hip. The biggest mistake I see is guys not level changing and winding up shoulder to shoulder. Go in here. I want to go. And then I'm finding inside position with my hands. So I can pass here, wherever. And once you have that drag of them bringing your hand down, you can set up drags where you grab their hands all day. The reason I'm showing you this one is because when he takes that hand off his head, he feels like he's in control. The fact that the hand's moving down, he's initiated that movement, and that it just gets off a little bit, doesn't set off the alarm bells in his head that I'm setting him up like it does if I grab his wrist, right? I grab his wrist and start to pull, he's gonna react immediately. When he's moving the hand, he starts the movement, it slows down his reaction. Does that make sense? Okay, thank you guys for that.